One TV special, 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 special report, special report. This time, friends, ladies and gentlemen, to give his message and to introduce our next guest speaker, it is my distinct honor to introduce a dedicated leader and a passionate advocate for our community. With a steadfast commitment to the growth and development of Misamis Occidental, he has consistently championed initiatives that uplift our people and our province prosperity. Under his leadership, we have witnessed remarkable advancements in various sectors, from education to infrastructure to agri-eco-tourism, all aimed at providing a quality of life for his constituents. His vision for a brighter future is matched only by his unwavering dedication to public service. Please join me in extending a warm welcome with a round round of applause, the Governor of the Province of Misamis Occidental, Governor Henry S. Waminal. Ang salamat, palihok, manglingkod. Miss Oak at 95! Asenso na! Asenso, Miss Amis Occidental! Asenso! Bagong busis, bagong bukas! Busis sa Asenso sa Senado! Thank you very much. This is Camille Villar for gracing our occasion today. Maraming salamat din. Extend to your dad, to your mom, to Secretary Mark for all the support that we have given to Ms. Amis Occidental. To our guest of honor, our good friend, our, be our best friend, Sa mundo, sa lahat na pagsubok ay may solusyon, which I will introduce properly later. Yusik Ferdinand Humapaw, representing Secretary Cristina Frasco of DOT, Kong Jison Almonte of the 1st District, Kongando Waminal of the Second District, Vice Governor Wing Gutierrez, and the members of the Sangguniang Palalawigan, may I request everybody to please stand our board members. Thank you. Our contingent from the city of Tango, Ona Angino. Represented by Mayor Ben Kanama. Our contingent coming from the city of Osames, represented by Mayor Henry Waminal Jr. Ang Pakpak nyo, mas kusog pa kaysa gobernador. Mas guapo manggong anak kaysa amahan. The contingent of the city of Oroquita, represented by Mayor Linwell Acosta. Our 
contingent coming from the city of Surigao, headed by Mayor Domlao III. Nasaan ang taga city of Surigao? Ayan, over there. Our contingent representing the province of Misamis Oriental, headed by Governor Peter Onabia. The contingent representing the province of Samwanga Sibugay, headed by Governor Hopper. The contingent coming from the city of Dipolo, represented by Mayor Dexter Oy. The contingent coming from the first district of Misamis Occidental, represented by the mayor's head of the first district, please stand up with Congressman Jason Almonte. Our contingent from the second district of Misamis Occidental, represented by Congressman Ando Waminal, may I request the mayors of the second district to stand up. <laughs> Director Elaine Onchoan of the DOT and all heads of the different national agencies local department heads and contingents from the capital. Where are you? <laughs> Tanang mga bisita, mga misamis nun, happy pirangat day. Miss Ock at 95. It is my great honor and my heart is filled with gratitude to see all of you today as we gather for our third Grand Pirangat Festival as part of our celebration of our 95th provincial anniversary. I am truly humbled and overwhelmed by your presence today, kaya akong nakita kung onsa kadaghan ang mga tao nga misaksi karon. Sukad pa ganinang buntag sa street dancing. And I can really feel the warmth and the excitement of each and every Misa Mission. This year's Grand Pirangat Festival is an upscale version from last year's festival as we have opened the competition to contingents from outside Misamis Occidental to outside the province, which is the first time in the history of any festival in our province. As we all know, the word Pirangat is a subhanin term that embodies a progressive way of life. It is going up, symbolizing our journey towards progress in achieving the vision of our province and aspirations captured in Asenzo Misamis Occidental 5 vision. Misamis non, magpuyong, malinaon, malambon, o malipayon. What makes Miss O truly blessed 
and festive today. Aside from the presence of this Kamil Villar, we are blessed to be visited with our distinguished grace. Tonay nakaibigan since our younger days as she was my boss in the Kabataam Barangay before. Look that picture. Sino yung pinaka-cute at guapa dyan? My 50,000 na premio. Oh. Nako. Gusto ata lahat magka-premio. Anyway, lahat kayo makatanggap ng premio or benefit to our PGMO employees. I will release next week your year-end bonus. <laughs> to the participating contingents, nakita ko kaninang umaga yung performance nyo at saka your readiness your preparedness in the showdown this afternoon. Gusto ba ninyo dagdagan ko yung premyo? O sige, kasi alam ko kilala ninyo yung guest of honor natin. Gusto niyo kumuha? Okay. The consolation prize which will be awarded sa wala sa Magic 5 yung consolation prize from 300,000 gawin ko ng 400,000. Ka kasi sip-sip kayo, kita ko. Ala, gusto niyong sumagot sa tanong ko. For the fourth runner-up from 500,000, gawin na natin 600,000. From the third runner-up from 750,000, gawin na natin 800,000. 50,000. Second runner up from 1 million to 1.1 million. First runner up from 1.5 million to 1.6 Million. And to the champion from 2 million to 2.1 million. Alam nyo, noon pa ang mga misamis noon ay mahal na mahal sa guest of honor and speaker natin na i-introduce ko. In the year 1978, she visited the Kabataang Barangays in Misamis Occidental, particularly in the city of Osamis. That was the first time and the First place in Mindanao to be visited by a presidential daughter at that time. Senator Aimee Marcos has been a public servant for more than four decades, starting as Kabataang Barangay 
I in her youth age to her present role as lawmaker. Boss, I me just like your governor during our KB days, we were molded by the Filipino ideology that was advanced by her father, the late President Ferdinand A. Marcos. Kabatang barangay before Kibi pa rin hanggang ngayon. Nagbago lang ang spelling. Dati kabataan, ngayon Kibi katandaang barangay na. Tumatanda sa paglilingkod sa ating bayan. Siguro, tinatanong niyo, ilang taon na ba si Boss Aime kasi she looks younger than her age? Ang sagot ko lang dyan, on November 12, she will be celebrating her birthday. Happy birthday, Boss! Manang Aimi, as she is affectionately called by kin, constituents and fans alike, became assemblywoman of her paternal province in Ilocos Norte. In 1984, she completed three terms as its congresswoman from 1998 to 2007 and served as many terms as its governor from 2010 to 2019. When she ran as senator in 2019, I invited her as my guest of honor in my na state of the district address. Kita nyo, maganda pa rin 2019 yan. Upon her election as senator of the 18th Congress, she assumed chairmanship of the Senate Committee on Economic Affairs electoral reforms, and people's participation, and cultural communities. In the present 19th Congress, she chairs the Senate Committee on Foreign Relations, Cooperatives, and Social Justice, Welfare, and Rural Development, besides maintaining the Electoral Reforms Committee. Senator Marcos hopes to replicate on a national scale the single-digit poverty incident she achieved for Ilocos Norte, crafting laws that create jobs and business opportunities that can cope with digital and more environmentally conscious future. Her advocacy is aligned on the vision of our Asinso. To recall, our province used also to belong to the top 10 poorest province in the Philippines. But today, under our care, Based on the latest PSA reports, Miss Samis Occidental is no longer in the list of poorest province in Mindanao. In support of the Bagong Pilipinas program of 
President Bongbong Marcos in reducing the price of price. Misok is the first province outside Manila to sell baratong bugas para sa misamisnon. BBM rice at 43 kilo kapisos per kilo. The Marcos family, since former President Ferdinand Marcos, has really loved the Misa Misnon well. Our President Bongbong Marcos has also greatly helped us, not only with the Pangilbi Bridge, the restoration of the peace and order of which he visited our place last September 27 in the declaration of insurgency province. His support, his support to us during the sheer line calamity which he personally came here in the province to personally deliver the national government assistance to the victim. We are really rewarded in our strong support to President BBM in the last election when he got 88% of the votes over his closest rival. This coming 2025 mid-year election, we will replicate again our love and care to the Marcoses. We will give our overwhelming support to the senatorial candidacy of Senator Amy Marcos. Of course, together also with this Camille Villar. Miss Oak at 95. Asenso Misamis Occidental. Ang ating Sinadura sa Asenso. Ladies and gentlemen, mga kababayan ko, ang ating kaibigan, ang ating ay solusyon, ang ating Sinadura sa Asenso, please help me welcome Senator Amy R. Barcos. Daghan salamat ha aton buotan nga gobernador an akon pinangga buotan pagtulog. Tinood nga serbisyo sa aton probinsya nga misok ay uh, akon kauban kaniadto sa kabataang barangay SK Pagihapon Governor Henry S. Waminal. SK pa talaga sanggunian katigulangan. Aray ko po. Maayong hapon sa aton labaw sa 20 mil sa kamis kamis kamisamis non talaga naman nakakamis yung mga araw ng mga bata pa kami kanindot od kadako jud sa atong venue diri sa Misamis Occidental Provincial Athletic Complex congratulations so much to be grateful for. 
tinuod nga limpyo o tinuod ana yung serbisyo sa ating gobernador, mga opisyales, at uh, tanan nga mga kagalang-galang. Congressman Ando Waminal, ang akon inaanak, ang aton hinigugma ng Vice Gov. Rowena Gutierrez, ang akon uh, kabatch, ang kapala no, nagpapakakabatch, Congresswoman Camille Villar. Hiyan na, kay bagets man yan. Ang aton Congressman Jason Almonte, ito na uh, 14, 14 nga board members, DOT USEC Ferdinand Humapaw, sus kasipsip sa pala ng pangalan ni mo, Ferdinand ka pala. Sus, ang aton This is sharing ng LGU mayors, kag vice mayors of Misamis Occidental, led by Mayor Ben Karamat. Ayan todo party sa co-op man, Mayor Indi of Osamis, usapan ng kabatch ko kay bagets pamanla, and of course ang kaka birthday palang Mayor Lem Acosta. Peking bagets iton kay puti na ang buhok. Inin Mayor Dumlao of Surigao, Mayor Sang Claveria, and aton na uh, contingent of Miss Or, kasama ko si Senor Pedro, usang adlaw, Sambo Sibugay and Hoffers Group. Dipolog ni Mayor Dexter Oy ang tanan nga grupo niton LGU counselors naton and LGU tourism officers and aton barangay officials sana ka mo mga barangay kusog pakpak kay ako yung ani inyong paglaom Pareho kami ng akong pinangangga ng gobernador, nag-umpisa man kami sa barangay. Kaya, forever na sa barangay at inyong term, six years na! Yehey tayo ng yehey, why pa? Idasal muna natin, oy. Sana, sana. At na-sponsor ko na iton. Ang ato na PD, Colonel Magleo, imported hamon sa Ilocanja, sa San Carlos. The uh, eight distinguished judges of the competition, stalwarts of Philippine culture from the Cultural Center of the Philippines. Ang uh, favorite projects na ako mama. Ang aton first lady Imelda Romualdez Marcos nga 95 years old gihapon. Happy birthday sa aton probinsya. Happy 95 years old. Ang aton five contingents from Miss Oak with the four guest contingents halata na Diri Ilocano ang aton gobernador dagdag kiti dagdag sa premyo <laughs> Nahadlok na ako kay basin ako naman ang tignan <laughs> PGMO Department Heads and aton heads of provincial and national agencies and aton colleges and academe All the provincial employees and aton mga hinigugma sa media, mga vloggers, tanan, mga misamis nun. Talaga naman, tuwan-tuwa ako na makapiling kayong lahat. At bago ako magpatuloy, bigyan natin ng pugay ang ating Subanon IPs, ang sadyang tribo ng probinsya. Alam natin, na ang tribong ito ay orig na Pilipino. Ang aton mga IP, mga original. Bago dumating ang dayuhan, 
Andito na sila. Sila talaga ang Pilipino na kailangan gayahin. At alam ko na talagang napakahusay ninyong sumayaw ang husay-husay. At alam ninyo, pareho rin sa akin pinanggalingan ng governor ako, Ingonera, imposible magkaturism kay siyang na probinsya ang harayo sa Manila. Sabi ko, kaya yan. May da kaming beaches, bundok, mga tanawin, ganyan din ang Misamis Occidental Zero Insurgency, 100% insurgency free. Misamis Occidental is back in business. Nako talaga naman, nalipay yun ako, kay mabalik-balik din he. Noong Pebrero, adi ako bumisita sa Oroquieta para mamahagi ng AX. Uh, gamay nga tulong, gamay nga buli, gaaton mga pubrihon. Kaya nagpapasalamat ako sa imbitasyon, Third Grand Parangat Festival. 95 years old. Happy birthday talaga sa ating mga subanen na kuyamis, ang misamis. Kayo ay talagang isang powerhouse na sinasabi sa agrikultura, ang aton uh, bugas, lubi, isda, mais, tanan nga root crops, and manufacturing sa kasangkapan, webless, itong tricycle, kadami talaga. Kaya sigurado ako na ang turismo ang next na ninyong pupuntahan. Deserve na deserve ninyo na dagsain ng turista ang napakadandang probinsya ng Miss O. Ito ay isa sa hidden gems. Kailangan lang maayos natin ang ating transportasyon para makapunta sila, makaikot at hindi masyadong mahalan tiket. May dagihapon barko at andyan na, binuksan na na ang ako, ang Pangulo Bongbong, ang atong Presidente, ang aton Panggil Bridge, itong two hours nga seven minutes na la ngayon. Karon madali na umikot at sana para ma-advertise ng todo-todo ang aton probinsya, sumama ang ating mga kabataan, lumikha sa aking contest ng Young Creative Challenge. Himuon ang mga kanta, ang mga istorya, ang mga film tungkol sa ating probinsya. I-advertise natin ang todo-todo. May dapapremyo, 1 million for animation, for film, script writing, 1 million sa kanta, 1 million sa game development, 7 million tanan-tanan. Kaya sigurado ako na may manalo sa Miss Oak dahil may street dancing kayo, float parade, kung ano-ano ang ating palabas ng ating mga katutubo. Bongga, bonggam, bongga, third grand perangat festival. Ang bongga nga talaga. Ang tinuod noon pa, ang pamilya ko, abala sa Miss Oak, nakita naman ninyo itong mga picture namin ni Gov. Henry na mga 19 kopong-kopong, nasa Malacanang na yan. Kaya, 1971, ang akong amahan, ang urig ng Presidente Ferdinand Marcos, Edralin Marcos Sr., 1971, Itinatag ang Northwestern Mindanao State College of Science and Technology. 
para magkaroon ng SUC din he Hamis Ock. Ayan, nagsilbing daan para sa oportunidad. At yung ama ko sa PD, sa kauna-unahang infrastructure PD, 1974, naglaan ng mga proyekto para sa probinsya. Ang tagal na niyan. Buhay pa kaya iton Kalamba Emergency Hospital, Misamis Occidental, unang ospital na atong probinsya ito, 19 kopong-kopong pa, pero mahalagang sentro ng kalusugan. Pati ang water system ng Misamis Occidental, dumaan kami nung bata para mag-inspeksyon, Nito mga artesian well o mga springs, nagbigay ng tubig, nga limpyo, haaton mga komunidad. At huwag kalimutan ang Clarin Water Works, ang kauna-unahang kompletong sistema na may kalinisan para kalusugan natin lahat. Ngayon na 100% insurgency free na, may dyan na tayo Pangil Bridge at nakita naman natin na talaga naman iba na ang Misamis Occidental. Nag-level up na tayo. Kaya nung COVID pandemic, ako ay nagpasa ng mas malawak, mas magandang pasilidad ng healthcare sa Mayor Hilarion Ramiro Medical Center para madagdagan ang bed capacity and professional services. Pati ang ating grupo dito, uh, alam ninyo na meron tayong mga iba't ibang project. Siyempre, hindi mahuhuli ang Barangay Captains as SK para ma-update sa kanilang linalakad na six-year term. Sayang la ang eleksyon basin kada taon. Nako. At syempre, kinahanglan ang atong mga LGU madagdagan ang budget. Kayong mandanas ruling, gobernador ako, siyam na taon. Akala namin na lalaki yung ira sa NTA. Imbes, sos, gamay nala. Kaya, kinanghanglan, amyendahan ang local government code at yung buo. Wala bawas, walang dagdag. Kailangan yan ang ibigay sa LGU dahil sa serbisyo ng LGU, the serve ng probinsya yan, the serve ng ating mayor at barangay. Pati na rin ang pagsama sa GSIS, ng tanan na elected officials. Kahit taon-taon nagsisilbi, 24-7 nagre-responde, wala naman mabigay sa pamilya pag naaksidente o nadali. Kailangan isama na sa insurance tanan ng mga elected officials. Pero nagsasaya tayo, enjoy tayo sa perangat, pero sa kabila nito, Lisod kaayo ang kinabuhi karon kay ang papalit nun, mga mahal tanan, pati yung bigas. Kaya effort na effort ang misamis na ipataas ang presyo ng bigas. Anong siling nila? Ingon akong utok, move on. Ingon akong kasing-kasing, hold on. Pero ingon akong tiyan, kaon kay mapas mo ta, kung gugma ang unahon. Totoo ba? Kamo talaga? Usap pa, usap pa. Akong gugma ni mo, murag biko, na ay latik, 
Pero walay sagol, atik. Aray ko, ano yan? Sa dami ng lubi, ambot nala. Kaya ito, uh, enjoy tayo rito at tulong-tulong maibagsak sa 40 at bawas pa ang aton bugas. At uh, talaga naman, uh, nasabot ako at kaya pabalik-balik, ikaupat na, mapalik ako dito. At uh, mayroon ako mga project noong 2021, gimpadala ko, 1.3 million na AX, tapos gindagdag pa, 7.6 million na liwat. Kaya uh, nagtitinuok ang atong pinangga, sus ginoo. Noong 2022, 30 million ang gihatag naton para sa mga dako si Bulen Plaridel Road. Ayan. Nagpakpakamo, tinuod tapos. Diri itong farm to pocket road. Farm to market road daw na totoo. Ayan, very good. And last but not least, nitong Pebrero, 6 million na liwat nga ayuda o AX para sa Oroqueta City. Kaya happy po ako, nandito na liwat sa makausa pa, akong kinasing-kasing na pasalamat sa matagusangan ni Tambong Karol ang ato 95th birthday provincial anniversary. Dili lang usa ka celebration sa atong mga nahimo sa miaging tuig apan usa usab kini na celebration sa mauswagon nga kaugmaon sa Misamis Occidental. Talaga naman ingon nila daghan ang atong problema. Ingon ko naman tinuod pero Ay mi solusyon. May solusyon. Tayo uban-uban ang tinuod nga solusyon. Happy birthday, Miss Ock. Happy Perangat Festival. Mabuhi ang Misamis Occidental. Daghan salamat sa inyong atanan. One TV special, 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 special report, special report. report.